This engine setting and locking kit includes all the essential tools you need to accurately replace the timing chain set 188200 installed in various Renault, Dacia, Nissan, Mercedes and Mitsubishi models accordingly. The tool set accordingly includes a locking tool for the flywheel, a locking tool for the crankshaft pulley and the corresponding adjustment tool for the camshafts as well as a locking pin for the chain tensioner. The timing chain has a conventional layout running on twin VVT camshaft sprockets and a crankshaft gear as well as two guide rails, a tensioner and a slider. Also there is a secondary chain running from the crankshaft to drive the oil pump. An unusual feature is the cylinder head design. The upper faces are machined at steep angles creating a triangular delta cylinder head that is very compact and lightweight. The Fawler pair always refer to the vehicle manufacturer's established instructions to establish the current procedures and data. Product information, detail applications, the use of the tools and any general instructions are provided as a guide only. Ensure the crankshaft sprocket timing mark is at the 6 o'clock position and the inlet and exhaust camshaft adjuster is positioned as shown. When removing or installing the crankshaft pulley bolt use the flywheel locking tool to hold the crankshaft in position. Remove the starter motor and install the tool ensuring that the adjustable tooth sits in the teeth of the flywheel. Remove the crankshaft pulley central bolt and the pulley, then remove the flywheel locking tool. After relieving the timing chain cover, install the crankshaft pulley central bolt, finger tight only. Turn the crankshaft clockwise until the key of the crankshaft gear is near the 11 o'clock position. Timing marks of the camshaft VVT sprockets should be also near 11 o'clock position, otherwise, Turn the crankshaft again. Remove the crankshaft pulley bolt and install the crankshaft setting tool. Make sure that the key of the crankshaft is located in the slot of the tool. Refit the crankshaft pulley bolt and slowly rotate the crankshaft until the key of the crankshaft is at the 12 o'clock position and the location hole of the setting tool is aligned to the threaded hole in the engine casing. Use a suitable bolt to retain the tool in the correct position. Locate the camshaft setting tools on the hexagonal profile of the camshaft VVT sprockets, ensuring that the marks on the camshaft VVT sprockets are at the 12 o'clock position. Retain in place using suitable bolts. Note the OE procedure for removing and refitting the camshaft VVT sprockets. Ensure that the camshafts are in the correct timing position before releasing the VVT sprocket bolts. Do not use the camshaft setting tool to counter hold the camshafts when removing or installing the camshaft VVT. Slowly compress the chain tensioner plunger by applying pressure to the timing chain guide rail, then keep the plunger in position using the locking pin. Remove the crankshaft alignment tool, the timing chain, and exhaust camshaft adjuster as an assembly. Before the assembly, ensure the crankshaft sprocket timing mark is at 6 o'clock and the crankshaft keyway is at 12 o'clock position. Ensure the camshaft holding tools are correctly fitted and install both camshaft adjusters, loosely tightening the control valves. Fit the new timing chain anti-clockwise, starting at the inlet camshaft adjuster. Ensure the colored chain link is aligned with the tiny marks on each camshaft adjuster and crankshaft sprocket. Then tighten control valves on camshaft adjusters. Install new tensioner rail and chain guides, followed by the tensioner. Then remove the chain tensioner locking pin. Recheck the alignment marks with the chain and remove the tools. Retake the crankshaft two revolutions clockwise. Finally, ensure the crankshaft key's timing mark aligns at 6 o'clock and both exhaust and camshaft adjusters are correctly positioned. As a final note, the crankshaft pulley bolt must be replaced. Do not start the engine without the auxiliary drive belt fitted as damage may occur to the crankshaft pulley.